ancient Earth's most bizarre prehistoric creatures. Have you ever imagined a shrimp as big as a dolphin, hunting fish, or a dragonfly the size of your dinner plate zooming through the sky? Welcome to a time when Earth was a zoo of oddballs. Bizarre animals roamed the Earth in every corner. In this journey, we'll meet 10 of the strangest critters from way back, from a fish with a circular saw for a mouth to a dinosaur with three-foot claws. These creatures look like they stepped out of a wild fantasy. Ready to be amazed and maybe a little creeped out? Buckle up, let's dive in and answer exactly what these freaky fossils are all about. Number 1. Anomalocaris, the Cambrian Unusual Shrimp Imagine a head like a shovel, a body like a noodle, and two spiny arms out front. That was Anomalocaris. Living about 520 million years ago, it was one of the first big predators on the Earth. Its name means unusual shrimp, but it looks nothing like the shrimp we know. Anomalocaris had a round, jawed mouth. Think of a pineapple slicer ring and a pair of long, grasping limbs to snatch prey. Its eyes were giant compound lenses, giving it a 360-degree view of the ancient seas. In short, it was a half-shrimp, half-worm monster. Number 2. Dunkleosteus – The Armored Jaws of the Sea Have you seen a fish that looks like a steel robot? Dunkleosteus, nicknamed the Dunk, was that fish. Living around 360 million years ago, it was a 13 to 26 feet long armored fish with a bite force estimated at 80,000 psi, enough to crush steel. Instead of real teeth, it had two pairs of shearing bony plates that acted like scissors. When it snapped its jaw shut in less than a second, its prey didn't stand a chance. Think of a fish with the head of a tank and the mouth of a guillotine. Dunkleosteus ruled Devonian oceans munching on armored fish and even other sharks. In a way, it was the prehistoric shark-chomping superhero. Terrifying yet awesome. Number 3. Arthropleura – The 8-Foot Millipede Ever gone outside and found a centipede? Imagine one as long as a grown-up. That was Arthropleura, a carboniferous millipede about 300 million years ago. Scientists say it was up to 8 feet long making it the biggest land invertebrate ever known. With dozens of legs and a heavy armored back, it must have looked like a giant living log with legs. Thankfully, it probably only munched on plants and decaying wood. Stumbling upon Arthropleura would be startling. A wriggling armored bug snake taller than a toddler. Kids today wouldn't want to step on it by accident. It ruled the swampy floors of ancient jungles far beyond the size of any bug we have now. Number 4. Meganeura – The Giant Dragonfly Next up, a dragonfly so big it could carry off a frog. Meet Meganeura, a monster insect of the Carboniferous around 300 million years ago. Its wingspan was over 70 centimeters, about as wide as a large hawk's wings. Meganeura had four delicate wings, huge compound eyes, and spiny legs that formed a kind of insect net to trap prey. Imagine seeing that fluttering toward you over a pond. Meganeura would look like a prehistoric helicopter or a pet dragonfly from Jurassic Park. It's thought that high oxygen levels back then allowed these insects to grow so huge. Today's dragonflies seem tiny by comparison. Number 5. Tully Monster – The Mysterious Monster Fish Dubbed the Tully Monster, this critter was so weird that scientists didn't know what it even was for decades. It lived about 300 million years ago and was roughly one foot long. Picture a torpedo-shaped body with a long, flexible proboscis tipped by a claw-like jaw. On top, it had eyes perched on little stalks, like periscopes, sticking out of its head. No one could tell if it was a worm, an eel, or something new, and it flummoxed scientists for years. Looking at a Tully monster, you'd think cartoonists had a field day. It's like an eel with crab claws and periscope eyes. 
In 2016, scientists finally identified it as an ancient fish-like creature, but it remains one of paleontology's strangest puzzles. Number 6. Dimetrodon – The Sail-Backed Predator Dimetrodon lived before dinosaurs about 290 million years ago, the Permian period. It wasn't a dinosaur at all, but a relative of mammals. Yet it looked like a lizard with a giant sail. Its body was about the size of a tiger, 10 to 13 feet, with a huge thin sail of skin and bone on its back. This sail could have helped regulate body temperature or display like a giant billboard. If you saw Dimetrodon by a lake, you'd first notice that sail. It's almost unfair how eye-catching it is. Imagine a pointy umbrella on a lizard. This predator probably hunted early reptiles and amphibians. So a sail-backed, toothy, saber-toothed lizard roamed Earth before the age of T-Rex. Number 7. Therizinosaurus – The Claw-Handed Dino Now, let's jump into the dinosaur era, late Cretaceous, about 70 million years ago, with Therizinosaurus. This thing was like a giant, flightless bird with enormous kitchen knives for hands. In fact, the Field Museum calls it the Freddy Krueger of the late Cretaceous because of its 3.3 feet long claws. Therizinosaurus stood up to 20 feet tall, had a long neck and stout body, and each of its front limbs ended in huge curved claws. It probably used those claws to pull down branches or defend itself. Picture a giant two-legged chicken crossed with a stegosaurus, minus the plates, and you're close. It's a vegetarian that could accidentally scare predators away just by waving its giant knives. No wonder paleontologists were excited when they first found its bones. Spinosaurus – The Swimming Dinosaur Spinosaurus was a dinosaur truly beyond belief. At around 95 million years ago, it grew longer than a T-Rex, about 50 feet. It had a crocodile-like snout full of conical teeth perfect for catching fish. Its back bore a sail of tall spines, but that's not all. Recent discoveries show its tail was like a giant paddle, making it a swimming dinosaur. Imagine a T-Rex with a snorkel and a surfboard tail. That's Spinosaurus. It would have spent much of its life prowling rivers and lakes, catching giant fish and even sharks. Between that sail and crocodile jaw, it looks like evolution had fun making this one. Number 9. Basilosaurus – The Snake-Like Whale Basilosaurus looks like a snake that grew a whale's head. About 40 million years ago, it was a top predator of the ocean, reaching around 60 feet long. However, it was not a dinosaur, but an ancient whale. It still had tiny hind legs, evidence that whales descended from land mammals, vestigial limbs that stuck out of its sleek body. Basilosaurus had a massive skull, nearly three feet long, with sharp teeth, and it likely snapped up smaller whales and fish. If you saw Basilosaurus swim by, you'd gasp at its serpent-like form. It had a long, slender body like an eel, but was definitely a mammal. Today we find its fossils around the world, proof that once, whales were as bizarre as any dinosaur. Number 10. Thylacosmilus the saber-toothed marsupial. We end our list with Thylacosmilus, a true oddball predator from South America, Pliocene about 5 million years ago. It looked like a saber-toothed cat, but it wasn't even a cat, it was a marsupial relative. Its upper jaw sported permanently growing fangs that stuck down past its lower jaw like built-in bayonets. These teeth and its strong neck made it a fearsome hunter of large mammals. Picture a big, lion-sized animal with downward-curving fangs that could stab prey in an instant. That's Thylacosmilus, nature's own saber-toothed shark on land. It roamed ancient forests with jaw-dropping teeth, hunting long before lions and tigers ever evolved. Ancient Earth was stranger than fiction. From 30-foot fish that could crunch steel to dragonflies you could catch, our prehistoric past was packed with surprises. 
These 10 creatures, and hundreds more we didn't list, remind us that evolution can get wildly creative. Next time you catch a glimpse of a butterfly or see a puppy, be thankful it isn't a mega dragonfly or a three-foot clawed dinosaur. And who knows what other bizarre beasts scientists will uncover next. One thing's for sure, Earth's story is full of wild chapters and there's always more to discover. Stay curious, explorers. The past has many more secrets waiting to be found.